Menu items become the most important element in the POS system. Menu items and categories need to be created on the POS to be displayed on the ordering page. Today, in this video we will understand how to create these menu items. For this, firstly log in to the POS system and go to the back office section. Under the products, go to the product list page. Here you can see a list of all existing items under their respective item groups or categories. On this page, in the right section, there are options to create, edit, or delete products. Now, to create a new product click on Add Product. This page opens. On this page, we have all these different fields. Now, let us understand how to create a menu item in the category with three portions. Add the product name, give an alternative name or you can use this field to add the name in a different language, add unique code or SKU of the product. In the category field, you can select from the existing categories or create a new category by adding the name of the new category here. You can add other details such as a tag, mention the course, add an image, and add a description for the product. Now click on Add Portion and add the different portions required. Add prices for different portions. If any item has just one portion then portion has to be normal. Force quantity and force price change will allow adding the quantity and price every time the item is searched manually. If the combo item button is marked it indicated that item is a combo item. We will see more about the combo item in the next video. After all the fields are filled click on save. Now, you can see the new menu item will be added to the list. You can edit or delete any item by selecting it, and then clicking on the required action. Sort Order button allows sorting the items. The Export Template button will download a template that can be used to upload items in bulk. Now let us see how to create items in bulk. Menu items are usually created in bulk only for the first time while setting up the POS. Firstly, export a template. Add the items and all other details and save the Excel sheet. Now, go to Settings, Setup, and Import. Here, click on this button and select the saved Excel sheet. Then, click on the Import menu button to create all the items listed on the sheet.